Wausau had a demolition company lined up, so if we wouldn't have come in and bought this, the entire facility would have been demolished. It would be completely gone, buildings and everything. Um, this is like walking back in time, because we thought they were just going to like liquidate it and leave the buildings, but they were actually looking at um, demolishing the whole thing, because right after we bought it, we got a call from that demo company asking if we would be interested in having them demo it. It's like, no, <laughs> you know, we're, we're trying to save it. Because, I mean, it's a, it's a historical um, building. So my grandfather moved down here from Canada, I think in the 20s, um, during a strike. And he actually helped put in some of this water line here. So it's... Kind of cool, a lot of family history here too. Um, we have part of one of the machines still here and we, we want to try to recreate a paper machine. I mean, not, not all the parts are still there because we've sold bits and pieces off, but, um, but we want to uh, try to give people the idea of how big a machine was. You know, a lot of people have never seen a paper machine. So. This milling machine is the piece that we came down to originally look at. We were interested in buying that, and somehow we ended up with the entire facility and contents and, <laughs> and everything. I think for some people, if they would have bought it, they would have just come in, totally scrapped the place, got as much as they could for it, and then just walk away from it. We're sort of doing it in a really slow manner. Um, you know, just for operating expenses, we'll bring in a load of stainless steel pipe. But we don't want to just get rid of it all. You know, it, it really is what's going to sustain us over the next couple of years. We, we sort of set some goals each year. Like our, our first year was, you know, get a tenant, and, and we did with the little bucket. We bought the company. The company had been around since 1925. And since we bought it, we've come up with, I believe, eight new mechanical whirly gig designs and introduced a line of winged whirly gigs. My vision is that this, this whole facility becomes a hub of activity. You know, multi-use, get some retail stores in here, we'll have the restaurant going, hopefully, you know, ice cream shop, maybe, um, you know, we'd really like to put in like a banquet room. For people to have, you know, there's no place around here for weddings and anniversaries and, you know, big groups. Um, maybe something over, like, by where the dam is, open up the view of the dam. And that's going to be a long know. process because it it's just takes time and money. It's all time and money.